it's time for more Wano. It's time for more One Piece. Zoro is clapping cheeks. Luffy is clapping cheeks. Now, I know the Zoro technically collapsed, and I do believe that he's going to be handicapped now, which is kind of a bummer because I was just ranting a couple episodes about how Zoro finally, we had an arc where Zoro's not handicapped, and what happens before the end of Act 2, he gets stabbed. Are we surprised? No. But what will happen? Because I... This is such a long arc that I do think that he could recover before the final big battle. And right now, what I want to know is what is going to happen between Queen and Luffy. Big Mom being all amnesiaed. What happens there? You know what I mean? Like, that's my biggest stressor, I guess, is Queen is, I'm assuming, going to have to fight, fight somebody. So is it going to be Luffy and Kid, who's still lost and we don't know where he is, or is it going to be Amnesia Bing Bomb? We're not gonna know unless we dive in. So let's check this out. And remember, if you want the videos months and months and months ahead, you can swing over to Patreon at patreon.com slash or you can become a YouTube member by clicking the join button. It's probably a little bit easier. And we put everything in the Discord for you. I mean, at this point, we just have to get the neck brace off. Once the neck thing is off, we're solid. This man is eating ramen. Oh, he's eating dumplings. Nah, get your red bean soup out of here, you piece of garbage. Fight him! <laughs> Why are they being so mysterious? Like, are you somebody we're supposed to know? Ew. Nasty ass. To Alpaca and Alligator Man. Okay. Never mind. So you're an armadillo man, not a medillo man. I don't know if any anything's called a medillo. <laughs> Bro, Luffy don't care at all. Oh, that's bad. Wait, what? Go right, crouch down, jump. Bro, no shot! Bro, Luffy's nailing it that well already? Bro, Luffy just flexing this future sight, man! <laughs> yeah! Bro, with C Prism Stone 2, Luffy just flexing on him, dude. Bro, he make a hockey spit. <laughs> dude, Luffy just flexing on him so bad, dude. <laughs> what the hell? I love this so much, dude. Bruh. I don't even care if these are sea prism stones. Get the hell out of my face. My hockey's stronger than your bullet, bitch. <laughs> Yo, King just chilling. Or Queen. Oh, he's like, this is exactly what I wanted. Nope. No, still not. <laughs> He's like, yo, I need help, dude. <laughs> Bro, you in no trouble. These guys ain't nothing. You don't understand, dude. Nobody beating Luffy with a fake ass devil fruit. Come on. What's happening to Beppo in the squad? Dude, does Law not like have any strong people on his crew or something? Like, like I love Beppo and I love his crew. Like I love their drip. I love their little penguin hat, but I don't, I don't know if it's just me. It feels like they're not that strong. 
Like, you know, Luffy, he got Zoro. He got Sanji, right? He got Brooke. He got Frankie. Like, they're pretty powerful. Where Law kind of seems like he's on his own just with his fam. You know, he's like, yo, they have a family. They ain't that strong, but it's okay. Yo, the old man probably getting whiplash. I love that they still think they are in charge. How much fucking soup this man want? Bro, I already see how this is gonna go. They, they gonna get there and be like, where's the soup? Be like, yo, that bitch ate it all. <laughs> and then Big Mom's gonna beat the shit out of him. How much goddamn soup you want, man? <gasps> Damn it. No, that was just again a normal punch. Nah, that wasn't what he was trying to do. Right? <laughs> He's just like, bro, this is life or death, man. What are you doing? <laughs> I guess it makes sense, right? Like, if he can annihilate people without touching them, then imagine what he could do with touching them, you know? All right, back to Zoro, back to Zoro. <laughs> She's like, bro, you weak as fuck. Don't do it yet. So maybe she is not as bad as I thought. Like, I thought she was kind of a bitch, but like, I mean, after standing up for, was it Toko, if I'm remembering her name right? Like, Standing up for her and then saving Zora. I mean, obviously Zora was protecting them, but maybe she's not as bad as she seemed. She did kind of seem like a bit of a scumbag, but that doesn't seem to be the case anymore. Yeah, welcome to Zoro. He's always getting handicapped. Girl, you have no idea. <laughs> Bro, she's probably so confused. She's like, hey, nobody ever talked to me like this. No, hell no. That's from Usab. That shit ain't gonna do nothing. Bro, I didn't realize how big this man is compared to freaking Zoro. Holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> Shattered Togo's oh man. It's because Zora's not entertained by anything, dude. How'd she know? <laughs> She's like, I can't really say this. <laughs> Yes, he does. <laughs> As he's just getting plastered, bro. <laughs> Holy shit. Bro. What? You know, I was just sitting here thinking to myself, what was the big thing that happened this episode? You know what I mean? I'm sitting here like, all right, Luffy fought, but he, he flexed his future sight, but he, he didn't actually succeed in doing what he's trying to do. Zoro, all right, he's safe. He's saved by them. Where's the big reveal? There it is. Bro, you've got to be kidding me. So she's been undercover this whole damn time, dude. She's not that bad. Oh my God, I can only imagine the comments raging when I was talking shit about her. I don't even remember when I was talking shit about her, but I'm pretty sure I was talking shit about her at some point.